Uh, Rob, you know that HBO Max is really doubling down on all the DC stuff that they yes. have coming, right? <laughs> so we've heard a lot of stuff. And one of the things that's really gotten a lot of attention is the Batgirl. And they just recently went out and got the, uh, the one of the young girls, Leslie, from In the Heights. I thought she was fantastic in In the Heights. So they recently cast her to be the new Batgirl in the Batgirl movie. Now, she was asked not long ago if, if Batman was going to be in the movie. And Leslie Grace said, no, Batman's not in this movie. He's off doing other things. However... Maybe she didn't read the script, or maybe they changed their minds, or maybe she was just trying to do a little bit of misdirect, because according to the directors of the upcoming live-action Batgirl film, Batman is going to be in it. Um, and this comes to us from the guys over at Joe Blow, and they were saying the, the thing, while chatting with something... Uh, Arby and Fahal danced around, revealing too much about the world's greatest detective fighting crime alongside Barbara Gordon in the new film. Now you're asking too much, uh, Arby said. I can say that it's really Batman, Batman. But who, we can't say. So basically, what they're acknowledging right now is that Batman is going to be in it. Now, by saying that, a lot of people are making an assumption, understandably so, that it's going to be Ben Affleck's Batman. Because we've already found out that Commissioner Gordon is not going to be played uh, by, who, who does the, uh, Jeffrey Wright? Jeffrey is Wright. not going to be played by Jeffrey Wright, who is the Commissioner Gordon in Robert Pattinson's Batman. But rather, he's going to be played by J.K. Simmons, who's, of course, the Commissioner Gordon in the mainline DCEU. And in that timeline, Ben Affleck is Batman. But it may not be Batman. They're saying, look, we're not going to say which Batman it is or who it is. So while a lot of us will assume it may be Ben Affleck, for obvious reasons, there's a lot of reasons to believe maybe it'll be somebody else. Number one, it sounded like, Bat like Ben Affleck was recently talking about his experience, Rob, uh, doing The Flash, which I think he only shot for a day or two. But... He was talking about, yeah, it was really good to put it on for one last time and blah, blah. So it sounds like he is, you know, he just kind of came in to get a nice little goodbye to the character. But, I mean, it doesn't sound like he's coming back, but maybe he will. But also the fact that they're playing a coy like this, because like, like, we can't say who it is. Like, I don't know, maybe it's Christian Bale. I highly doubt it's Christian Bale. But, you know, something along those lines. So, Rob, you hear that they are indeed going to have Batman, Batman, as they put it, in this Batgirl movie. What do you think about that, and who do you think is it going to be? Is it going to be Affleck? Is it going to be Robert Pattinson? Is it going to be one of the other guys? Is it going to be somebody completely new? Is it going to be a play on words? What do you think about this? <laughs> well, you know, it's funny not knowing how they're going to go with the Robert Pattinson Batman. I, I don't know, but I would I would lean toward believing it would be him because he's the new Batman that they're probably going to have a trilogy of Batman movies with. But if it's going to, if that Batman film is going to be self-contained like the, um, like the Christopher Nolan Batman movies, if they went with Batman and Batman's going to be in it, and there's a Batgirl film. I would not be surprised, John, if it's Ben Affleck, because in a way that continues the Snyderverse films and it becomes, there's continuity with Wonder Woman and Aquaman and everything else. So uh, it would be a nice nod the same way that Affleck was in Suicide Squad. And I think from what I've read, you know, Ben Affleck came out and said he's had a good time making the Flash movie. So if someone came to him and said, hey man, could you uh, kick it with get Batgirl for a few days? I could see him going, why not? I mean, wouldn't that be cool? Now, you're mentioning The Flash, so let's bring up another possibility. What if it's Michael Keaton? I mean, could it be Michael Keaton? You know, I, and because he's playing, he's playing a much more predominant role in The Flash than, say, Ben Affleck did. And if they're going to be resetting some things with Flashpoint, and obviously we're now just, we're pure speculation. Yeah, like, yeah. rainbows out of our asses, pure speculation yes, the, the, right now. Absolutely. But, I mean, could Michael Keaton be a viable option to be that Batman, Batman? What do you think? Well, since we're being friendship is magic in terms of our speculation, <laughs> um, why not? I mean, an older Batman, and they, they might change the storyline where if it's Barbara Gordon, who's Batgirl, 
she like Batman watched her grow up and and they could skew it you know she's younger depending on how they're going to play it so I could see that I mean either way whether it's Ben Affleck or whether it's um, Michael Keaton I think that's both of those are a winning formula whereas if you have Batgirl in the Matt Reeves Batman universe I think that's a bit too soon I, I it just doesn't seem like that would be the best fit because Batman seems to be younger and I don't think that they would want to co-mingle those characters quite yet well yeah but, but then, and yeah, also with wrong. J.K. Simmons being the Commissioner Gordon in this and we know Jeffrey Wright is Commissioner Gordon and Robert Pattinson's Batman that seems like that can't fit it seems no. like they couldn't put those together. No, no. And I, I would say that if, is it J.K. Simmons? Have we, is that confirmed? I, I believe they confirmed that, yeah. For the Batgirl movie? Yes. Well, so then it's got to be Ben Affleck, doesn't it? Or it could be Michael Keaton. I mean, Michael Keaton or, is now in Ezra Miller's Flash, or it could be something could else be. entirely. I mean, it's, it's, a, it's an interesting question. The question is for you guys. What do you think about this? The directors are now saying, even though the star of the movie said before, Batman's not going to be in it, the director's now saying he is. So who do you think is it going to be? Maybe there's something we're not considering in it. Very well could be Robert Pattinson's Batman. Maybe it could be Christian Bale, although that is completely almost impossible. Uh, maybe it's Michael Keaton. Maybe it's Ben Affleck. What do you think about it? Who's going to be this Batman? Whatever do you guys think, jump down into the comment section below and let us know your thoughts.